So I'm hooking up an Aris surfboard SB60190 to an Asus router. This is the model AC66U, which has AI mesh. It's going to be the primary router, and I will set up nodes throughout the house to straighten the signal. Um, usually you want to keep the outer ones at a 45 degree and the middle one can be straight up. Now you're going to call up Cox or your provider to hook this up first. You, it, it connects to a coaxial and has one ethernet port. Once you give them the serial number and they activate the internet, you will hook this up through the coaxial. The one port, ethernet port connects to the blue port on this router. And then you're gonna any one yellow port you can hook it up to a laptop and you're gonna go to www.router.asus.com I'll show you that right now so once you have it hooked up to your laptop something uh, stationary or wherever you are um, this is the website you go to router.asus the main login usually it's admin uh, you can google it and I'll put it in the details as well but I have changed my password because my previous router was an Asus once you log in this is what you get you might get a quick internet setup you're gonna go through the setup it's fairly simple I'll see if uh, mines will go through so it will give you the setup and then you want to set it up uh, most of the options you keep as single ones. Um, it's very self-explanatory but once you go through you're able to You'll see that it's connected to the internet and through here you can go to many different options one of the main things you want to do on the main router is Go to administration and then you're gonna go to firmware upgrade and then you can check this and you want to make sure you're on the latest version and also do that with the node routers but once this is set up you set up your Wi-Fi it says mine's the current version and you can see I have internet Wi-Fi is set up now we're gonna go over to setting a node in another room as you can see here, I've set up the second router, which is just an AC66U as an access point with a direct connection. So from the settings, I have chosen this one, AP mode. And that what you do is with the main router, you hook up one of the ethernet ports, one of the yellow ports from the main router and you hook it up directly to the blue as you can see here to the blue port which is the black ethernet right here and then you're able to configure it using an access point as you can see here it says access point and what this does is it just extends the signal using this router and my main router in the hallway so this just amplifies the signal and when we go down here as you can see this is the repeater pretty much it's amplifying and it's got full bars this is my main router in the hallway which is lower signal as you can see and then this is the 5G frequency for my main and then these two are the, the signal from this router so now when I'm in the garage I will use the repeater so that I have a better signal and you can use this utility from Asus to get the IP address to log in now that you have two routers you're going to want to make sure you log in with the correct IP address so this tool right here it identifies it for you so that you can log into each individual router makes it a lot easier and i'm right here it says right here ap mode and you can go ahead change the password and the names and uh, if you ever wanted to 
You of course, if you buy it used, you wanna first hold the reset button on the back of the router, reset it. And uh, you can just check here. Mines are up to date, but you wanna make sure they're up to date. And other than that, there's a bunch of other things you can do. And to show you what I mean by these IP address, as you can see, this is the repeater. I'm, I'm logged into the access point my AC66U. Now I'm gonna log out of this. And when I type in router.asus.com, this is my AC66UB1. And you can see this is the wireless router. Another thing, if you have multiple AC66UB1s, you can put it in AI mesh node. So you're, you will have the, the default wireless router and you set up the other ones as AI mesh node. Now you can do those wirelessly or you can bridge it by putting the main routers, uh, one of the yellow ports into the blue port of the one that's going to be a node to get a better uh, connection and uh, you're gonna want to use repeater mode if if you want to let's say you you have just the AC66U if you want to hook up if you want to extend the signal you will go on repeat mode which acts as a repeater and this is wirelessly so you do not need to hook up one of the yellow ports from the main router to the blue port of this. But if you have a way to do that, that's a better connection, go ahead and do it. If not, if let's say one's in the garage and one's um, in, the in the house, then you're gonna wanna use repeater mode and this will wirelessly connect to another router to act as a repeater and extend the signal. But since I have a direct connection, I have it under access point, which the yellow port from my main router will hook up to the blue port of this router. And of course I've reset both routers initially because I bought them used. And um, you can, uh, I'll, I'll put down the details how to get into it. But most of the time your main router will just be router.asus.com. And then you can use this utility to find out your uh, repeater routers um, IP address to log into that. Always log out of this one. And as you can see, it's my B1. And when I use the other IP address, point 50.17, it's my other router. It logs into the other router. So this is very uh, easy to use. This is my other router and I can go through add parental settings and whatnot. Or if I need to update it or change the passwords, I can do all that by uh, logging into each router's settings.